Hello everyone, today I'm going to show you how to make this cool door that opens like a zipper and closes like a zipper too. And um, it's very simple to build. This isn't my design though, it's um, from a Mumba Jumbo video, but it doesn't really show you how to build it, even though it's really easy. So I'm going to show you how to build it now. So what you need to do first is figure out where you're going to be powering the door from. So I'm going to build it right over here and I'll power it like this so my pressure plates will go on top. And then what has to happen is the redstone will come around like this. And I'm sure there's a better way to do this, but this is just how I figured out how to do it. Um, you have it running into non-sticky pistons, and then there's observers facing down, so they get powered when the sticky piston goes on, or when the piston goes on, and then when it goes off. So then what you're going to want to do is add all the pistons in. So this this is a really easy part. And this is the entire door. It's just sticky pistons facing inwards as high as you want it. And this door can go as high as you want it. For now, I'm going to do... What is that? Eight? I'll do 10. So what you need to do next is you can s oh, it's not going to work yet. Um, you need to have observers looking down redstone dust on top of each one, just like this on each side, just going all the way up And done. Now what you're going to do, you can do this really whenever you want, but you have to put in the blocks. You could have done this first, but it's easier last. You just place in all the blocks that are going to be the actual door. And just like that, and then you can make a door frame of some sort. And when you build this, it will be in the um, open state. And then when you walk on the pressure plates, it'll actually close. So what you need to do to fix that is get some block you can break instantly, like a torch or a slime block. And just update those observers and break it right away. So it takes that as one signal. And uh, it'll just alter the effect of the redstone signal. So now you can cover up the ground and that is the whole thing completed. These doors are really fun, especially if you make them really tall because they can just open like forever basically. It'd be really cool to have a really tall one and you just watch the You know, watch it go all the way up. I do have a taller one over here, so I can show you that. And then there's this one, but I think it might be broken. It appears to be broken. Oh, I just need redstone here. Okay. So yeah, they're really easy to build. 
super fast, and um, they don't take a lot of materials unless you don't have a lot of cobblestone for the pistons. But, yep, that's it, and I'll see you in the next one.